It was a perfect July night for a drum corps show, the Whitewater Classic 2022. But this was more than just another contest. This place is so rich in history, so deep in memories. That first championship here in 1972 was the ultimate gamble. That first Drum Corps International World Championship held here in 1972 had everything riding on it. If it failed, this young confederation of Drum Corps would likely go down with it. Each Corps director had signed a personally guaranteed note for $2,000 to get this thing started. So why Whitewater, Wisconsin? One of DCI's co-founders, Dave Capture, reflected on that in our Brass Roots documentary of 25 years ago. I selected this site uh, because they were interested in a Drum Corps Midwest show. I came over here and said, you got to be kidding. Do I have a deal for you? Merchants and the uh, local community got really behind it. Whitewater banker Julius Brandt was on the local committee that brought the show to town. Surrounded by three generations of his family, he got a nice shout out during this year's Whitewater Classic. Thank you for making this such a crown jewel in DCI history. Still a drum corps fan, at age 89, Julius remembers that event 50 years ago warmly. It was great. I mean, you had to be happy uh, and um, whatever to uh, just to see it go, to see it take off. And take off it did. The fans came early. Traffic backed up on the two-lane country roads leading into Whitewater and at the stadium gates. I guess I was so excited to see you <laughs> be here and be a part of this. Trudy and Dan Hutzinger were in a corps that didn't compete that year. So they were among the fans who packed the stands, making indelible memories in the process. The, just the sheer number of drum corps that year that competed was amazing to me. The way the crowd would just stand up and cheer. And, yeah. Yeah, um, <laughs> yeah and, and these stands were fall. They were fall. The 73 championship in Whitewater was another success. Drum Corps International was off and running thanks to a community that opened its arms and said, why not, let's do this. Julius's thoughts sitting in those stands 50 years later? I just hope it continues and grows um, and uh, because the kids need this. It's, it's a great experience and um, it's a learning experience and the, what they get out of it uh, will help them throughout life, that's for sure. As a core kid, I can attest yeah. to that. <laughs> right.